All right, so how you guys doing? Um, today I'm going to show you an easy way to uh, unspool the line on your fishing reel to put new on. And, you know, we've all had the problem of having to pull it off and it takes too much time. And so today I'm going to show you a fast and easy way to do it. And you can do it with stuff and materials around your house so let's get to it all right what you're going to need is a razor blade or something to cut your fishing line off the ends you're going to need a old fishing spool that holds line it needs a reel of course and you're going to need a drill and you're going to need you gotta watch this carefully. What you gotta do is you gotta find like an old highlighter or something that you can shove or anything like a drill bit will work perfect. But I don't have one right now, but anything that you can shove in here and get where it won't move, it'll turn. And then you take your drill and take it and put it over. Hold on a minute. And you take your drill and put it over that. And then you clamp it down. See, now it's, it's going to work now. Now the next step is to get your fishing line on this spool. So now what we have to do is take our line that we want to take out of the old fishing reel. And tie a knot onto the spool so we can unstring it. This ain't got to be a tight knot. It's got to be a simple knot. You don't got to have it tight. Okay. I got my knot. Use your razor blade. Cut off excess. Cut it off. Alright, use that to cut that off. And now see what we have here is your drill and your fishing reel. And your line is attached to it, right? Alright, you unlock the bait cast or you unlock whichever reel you have and you just start you sit this down on the floor, sit your reel down on the floor, and you take hold on let me switch the camera. And you take the line and you just mash the drill and you feed the line in yourself. You feed the line yourself. You just keep it running left to right. Keep it going. It may take a minute. And also, when you're doing this, be sure to keep an eye on how much line you got left on your reel. Because it will jerk. And now, see, what we have is all your line on the reel. And you can cut it off of the reel. Well, you got all your line on your spool. You can cut it off on the reel. And it's just a faster way to take it off. And it'll save you and me and whoever wants to try this out time and so uh, I hope you guys are going to try this and it saved me a bunch of time and uh, I hope you guys like this and comment rate and subscribe on my videos and let me know what you think and uh, appreciate it